welcome back lifelong learners today we're going to be comparing the Rode Wireless Go and the um, Sennheiser XSWD you're probably wondering why I'm like this it's because my wife left me to go to a bachelor rent party <laughs> in Vancouver and <laughs> she's sending me waterfall pictures because she knows I love waterfalls and then she's like and then her friends posting pictures of her walking through the woods and stuff I'm sitting here like I'm gonna go get it real quick because I'm gonna show you what I'm feeling right now <sighs> literally this is what I'm feeling right now mm -hmm. that's exactly what I'm feeling like eating a jelly donut. <laughs> oh my goodness, I got like sugar all over me. I'm going to stop recording real quick. I'll be right back. So today, what I want to show you is I took the Rode Wireless Go left channel and the um, XSWD right channel. So I took this and tested it out in the streets because I plan to do uh, vlogging with my GoPro and I wanted to see what that would sound like. And here's what that sounds like. All right, so what's up, lifelong learners? I am going to record this right here that the audio meters are pretty good. They're set roughly the same. There it is, XSWD and the Rode Wireless Go. I know I'm looking weird right here, but I'm trying to record this. And so people would know that the settings are pretty much the same and I'm speaking to you guys normal. So this is what it would sound like, I'm like, kind of blown out too <laughs> but anyways yeah this is just an audio sample all right so the next test was inspired by someone who commented in my um, on one of my videos and they asked me to test it in like a crowded room like a church type setting and so there was a performance that is put on every year by Cambodian Student Society and I was actually president one year and I decided, hey, you know what? what, why don't I just go test it there? So you'll see a video of a test in the actual theater and then a test in the lobby. So see what you guys think of this one. All right, so you see my hand here? Oh, I just kicked the camera, oops. You see my hand here? Yeah, I'm gonna be walking all the way up to the front of the room. Hey, what's up guys, how you doing? Hi. Give me some love, man, there you go. <laughs> all right, so I'm gonna run over and I'm going to go and try to get to the hi to the front of the stage. I'm testing some wireless mics right now. How are you doing? Hi, Give me some love. Mm, thank you. All right, gotta run to the front. Sorry about that, sir. Oh. All right, so this is the range test. I am roughly, I am roughly about oh I don't know, a good maybe 50 feet or so, but definitely not the uh, 70 meters that we're supposed to get here. So I want to make sure that we get this audio with this room full of people. So yeah, this, this is what it sounds like. All right, I'm gonna make my way back. This is the recording of my hand of the Sennheiser and the Rode. And then these are the levels right here. They are pretty much the same. These are my settings on my GH5. And I'm going to go all the way up to the stairs. And this is what it sounds like when you're in a room full of people. Somebody requested that I do this for a test. And I'm walking all the way to the stairs here and through people and I'm hoping that you're still hearing me left and right and I'm gonna go up to the top real quick so that I can get this sound and I'm gonna run up the stairs here so that you can see at what it sounds like when I am up here in the stairs and I'm waving at the camera right there and I totally ignored a whole bunch of people to get up here nah he flew out to Mexico City Right. Yeah, he was like, hey bro, can you drop me off at 1.30 today at LAX? I'm like, bro, I'm like on spring break, but I'm observing another school <laughs> on my spring break. <laughs> because I'm going to learn broadcasting, and so I wanted to, you know, you know me, I'm always like, yeah, lifelong learner, man, you know, you know, educator. It's not just the uh, school district's like, motto, it's his motto. It's, it's, it's just me, yeah, it's just me. <laughs> hey man, when you're on the mission to make the hood all good, I'll rest when I die. <laughs> I'm gonna vlog with like a giant tripod. So, so here, I'm gonna go outside 
talk to these random kids over here. <laughs> they, they, they see me over there. Hold on. They see me over here. You hear that, Mr. Hank? Hey! No, the <laughs> so, yeah. Squad. Squad. Yeah, we're on video, man. It's on the video. <laughs> you guys know you're going on YouTube. <laughs> No, I'll blur you guys, I'll blur you guys. Some of y'all too ugly. Some of y'all too ugly. <laughs> Love CSS forever. Okay. Uh, what else should I say? Let's, let's step back. We can still hear you because I'm mic'd up. Oh, what's up? So I keep, keep walking back. All right. We're oh. doing a range test. Keep All talking right. to the range camera. Test? Oh, hello. Yeah, see? I got the mic right here. All right. Yeah. Welcome. You're looking at Hang It Up Photography right here. <laughs> Mr. Hang 562, let's go. There you go. <laughs> Subscribe and hire him. <laughs> go higher like this <laughs> all right so the last test was me walking to um my football field i, I didn't walk there i mean i drove there and then uh i put my camera on the zero yard line which is the end zone and then i walked across and did a whole test so you can check that out all right hi everybody i am just going to show you my setup here here is the uh xswd in channel two and then the road in channel one and this is my setting for the road right here because uh, the xswd has no setting <laughs> and then if you're looking at the audio meter right here it is pretty much the same and it's kind of windy and i am uh actually i'm going to turn this one off so you can see me right here hopefully it's on auto continuous focus here um, i'm gonna flip it over all right and <laughs> i'm back lit <laughs> sorry but this is not about a video quality test, this is about audio. So I'm going to um, walk to about the uh, 70 yard line because that's where the range for both of these will be. And then I'm gonna walk facing you guys first. So you can hear any dropout and it's kind of windy so it's kind of working out in my favor. So here's a 10 yard line and the wind I'm hoping get picked up and then uh, keep me talking to you so you can hear me. And now I'm on the 20-yard line, and I'm going to keep walking here. I'm not going to be like Max and not know what to say <laughs> because I actually have distance that I can measure. So this is 30-yard line right here, and I'm going to keep walking back until I get to the 70-yard line. Here I am um, at 40, and then I'm going to keep walking back, and I'm, wa I'm wondering if you can actually hear the uh, wind noise. And here I am at the middle, which is at the 50-yard line and I'm going to keep walking back and I'm almost there. So here's the other 40 yard line, which is the 60 yard line. And then I'm gonna keep walking, keep walking, and I'm gonna get here to the 30 yard line, which is roughly 80. So I'm going to be, um, actually, actually not 80, 70. So I'm going to turn my body and I'm going to block the uh, XSWD so let me know if you guys can hear me or not. The road is facing uh, you guys right now, the camera, and then I'm gonna f turn over and I'm going to wireless go. And now the XSWD is facing the um, camera. So now I'm going to walk back to the camera and I'm gonna tell you a story that uh, this here, this location here is the hardest location for me to shoot at at school because it has some kind of weird frequency where it cuts everything out. Uh, I've used my XSWD here and it fails. I've used my Sennheiser AVX here and it failed. And I've used my um, Wireless Go here and it kind of failed too. So every time I turn and face away from the camera blocking the receiver, it fails. So I want to know what you guys think of this audio right here. I mean, if you look at my setup, you can actually see me set up both mics using the Sennheiser ME2. And just to give you a rough idea of what this sounds like. So please ignore the back lighting. Please ignore the dark Asian man in front of you right now. But just listen to the audio. And hopefully this helps you make a decision on which one you're going to buy. And which one is actually better for the range test and my body blocking. Um, earlier like turning the Sennheiser blocking and then turning this direction and then blocking the road from you guys let me know what you guys think I'm gonna go back home now because it's cold it's cold Whew. 
now you're gonna probably ask me, so Mr. Hang, which one do you recommend? Uh, honestly, I feel like the Wireless Go is the one to go with. <laughs> Wait, did I just <laughs> go with? Okay, so I wanted to interject really quick and I am now on the uh, Wireless Go going straight to my Canon EOS RP. Um, but I want to interject with two videos and these two videos are both from NAB. And the first video is going to be with Ted using the XSWD, Ted Sims from Aperture. And the second video is going to be with Peter McCabe, who was also around me near the Aperture booth. And I want you to hear the difference between the two when I'm using the XSWD with um, Ted Sim and him speaking about how great I am as an educator. <laughs> and then meeting Peter McGabe for the first time and he had the wireless go and so we were all excited about using the wireless go and just plugged it into my camera, my EOS RP, and then we just go with it. <laughs> so enjoy the video and I'm not slamming Sennheiser, but they did warn me that it was gonna be like really tragic audio if I'm gonna use the XSWD at NAB. You know, I, I just didn't take their advice. I just wanted to test it out for myself and here it is. All right, so we're back with the IT! <laughs> Students of Mr. Hung, yeah. how you doing? What's going on? How's your filmmaking journey going? Great, because like I took your advice. I started buying cheap gear for them so that they, if they break it, it's all yeah. good. You know, like I can always replace it for them with the little scraps of money I make from YouTube. That's great, <laughs> for sure, man, absolutely. Hey, but, treat your gear nice. You got a great teacher here. Oh, a great you. teacher that's putting a lot of effort. That's really working. Honestly, last year he was like, I got these students. They need better gear. He was and if this guy's hustling for you, you know, he might not even play this video. I hope he plays. I'm going to make him play this video so that you guys see how hardworking this guy is and how lucky you are to be students of Mr. Hung. Uh, thank you so much. For sure. Man. Absolutely. Thank you so much, man. I need to, I'll let you go back to your work because you got a lot of people to talk to. For but sure. Thank you for saying what's up to my students. It's good to see you guys. What's going on? All right. Sure. I'll see you later. Hold up. I, I'm getting to play with this, and I mic'd my camera up with this wireless Go from Rode. Wow, <laughs> I'm hoping that this is not having issues like my XSWD was like cutting in and out, in and out, in and out. I was like, uh, 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 remix, that was it. Like, and oh, we're getting this glorious light right here too. We are, we, 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 we're really <laughs> like, hitting it I, off I'm, now. This is, we, you look like, you I'm, know. I'm looking glorious. You look, you look fabulous too. I, yeah. Wow, <laughs> this light, <laughs> which one is this? Is this the 300? <laughs> The 120D Mark II. Okay, I'm getting this light. All right. you, you're getting it. You gotta have it. Everyone's so, gotta have this. And and this wireless go right here. You guys tell us what you think of this audio right now, because I'm seeing the 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 meters peak, but I don't think it's hot. I don't think it's hot no, at all. Your camera's taking it in hot. Yeah. So, guys, let us know what this sounds like right now. And you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna walk away from the mic and you talk to me. Okay. So yeah, I picked this up this morning and I was kind of blown away at how great it sounded and, and all the ambience uh, that it picks up from the built-in mic. You can also hook up a lav to it, which is really amazing. So if, if you got the time, but what's great is you can just clip this on and, and, and you're ready to go. And the, the other cool thing is you can handhold it and do an interview with it and there's no handling noise. So I can bring somebody else in and have a conversation with them. And supposedly you can get about 200 feet. <laughs> Yeah, just, just go with it because the XSWD is good, but not as good as the Wireless Go in terms of price, in terms of feature, and in terms of size. Because you, you hear it for yourself and it's not like I'm trying to sabotage Sennheiser or anything, but the Wireless Go just works better. It lasts longer in terms of battery. It has more features to be able to plug in the mic or not. I seem to get a battery life that's longer, close close to seven hours like that was advertised. It wasn't seven plus hours. The transmitter was seven plus, no, the receiver was seven plus hours, but the transmitter was dying around six and a half hours of use because I started at eight o'clock and it ended like around 1.30ish because I was vlogging yesterday. So yeah, hands down, go with it. I don't want to ramble on and on. Wait for my full review of the XSWD and the wireless go. Let's just say goodbye. Get your hands ready. Rock, paper, peace. Let's hang out again in the next video. Get it? Hang out. <laughs>
And by the way, I have a fan club in Thailand. What?